Let's cross now to news.com.au to see what's happening online. Alison Stevenson joins us now at News Headquarters. Good morning, Ali. Now, smartphones are about to get a lot more flavoursome. Please explain. That's true. Good morning, Tash and Matho. Now, look, imagine being able to taste all the sugar you want without getting fat. Now, it sort of sounds like something out of the Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, but researchers in Singapore from the National University over there have actually developed what, we, what they're calling a digital lollipop. So it actually simulates taste without having any of the calories. So you actually put a little electrode on your tongue and it simulates the taste of salt, sweet, bitter and um, and sour as well and it delivers that straight to the mouth so it sort of uses an electric current to imitate the the primary taste sensation so it does sound a little bit like the everlasting gobstopper doesn't it a little bit I'm kind of <laughs> concerned what are some of the practical uses what do they think they're going to use this for well, apart from being able to satisfy that sweet tooth without it going to your hips, um, they think it might actually have some medical uses as well. So people with diabetes who can't really eat loads of sugar or have to be quite careful about their sugar intake could actually satisfy that, um, that sweet craving without having to ingest any actual sugar. Um, they also think that cancer patients who have um, a diminished sense of taste after chemotherapy could have their taste buds stimulated by this. And you also could perhaps be able to taste some of the, um, the things that they're making on cooking shows, such as MasterChef. So imagine being able to sit at home and taste what they're cooking up. Sounds pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah, it's, uh, it's exciting, some applications. I'm a bit wary of being able to taste the internet. <laughs> um, <laughs> sounds disgusting. Ali, thanks so much for joining us this morning. Thanks, guys.